The Airbus A380 was not just the world's largest passenger jet. It was the first airliner with a digital nervous system built on Ethernet. Not the Wi-Fi kind, but a hardened aerospace version called AFDX. AFDX, Avionics Full Duplex Switched Ethernet, is Ethernet re-engineered for flight safety. It is deterministic, meaning data packets always arrive within strict time limits. And it is redundant. Every message is sent down two separate network paths, so if one fails, the other instantly takes over. The result? Flight critical commands reach their destination with guaranteed timing and reliability. Earlier, Airbuses like the A320 used A-Rink 429, a rock-solid system but point-to-point. -point. Every function needed its own dedicated wire. That worked fine on smaller jets. But with the A380 sheer scale, over 500 kilometers of wiring already on board, the old system was impractical. AFDX allowed multiple computers to share a common switch network, cutting wiring complexity and saving weight. On the A380 and later the A350, AFDX became the backbone of the avionics network, carrying flight controls, monitoring data and cabin systems. Boeing's 787 also adopted a similar switched Ethernet approach. By contrast, older jets like the A330 or 747 relied mostly on A-Rink 429. In short, the A380 was the first airliner to think like a data center in the sky. So the next time you see an A380, remember, beneath the giant wings, is an invisible nervous system sending thousands of messages every second. But here is the question. Did Airbus get it right, making a super jumbo a flying server rack? Or did Ethernet push aviation into a level of complexity no jet ever needed?